Today we're doing another video on how not to waste our plastic spaghetti when we're 3D printing. So in part one and part two, we covered some really solid ways of how to reduce the waste or poop when you're 3D printing. Calibrating flushing volume. By default, Bamboo Lab Studio uses a safe amount to purge filament every time it changes materials. But the number is a bit bloated for most of us. Head to your AMS settings and you'll see flushing volumes for each filament. If you've been printing a lot and you know your colors aren't drastically different, especially if you're switching between similar shades, you can reduce these volumes by 30 to even 50%. Now if you're going from black to white, you don't want to skip too hard, but for light to light transitions or minor shifts, test reducing the purge. You'll be shocked at how much filament you don't waste. Plan color orders the best you can from light to dark. This one is all about strategy. When you're designing a multicolor print, or even just deciding what to load into your AMS, order matters. Swapping from dark colors like black or red to white means more purging, but the other way around, much less. So if possible, arrange your colors from dark to light in your model if it fits your design. And if you're printing multiple parts on the same build plate, always start with the lighter object first and then go to the darker one. It's like in painting, darker colors cover lighter ones much easier. Same idea, except we're dealing with molten plastic. 